Courage, written by Bernard Weber. Students, before we read, we're going to look at the cover and we're going to think about the purpose of why we're reading this book. So look at these options. Do you think our purpose is to A, to have a better understanding of what courage is, B, to find out examples of courage, C, to help me think about how I can have more courage, or D, all of the above. What do you think the purpose of reading this book is? So pause the video and talk for one minute with your group about what you think the purpose of reading this book is. Okay, now students, during the reading of this story, you have a job to do. So write this sentence and fill in the sentence as you listen to the story. The courage example of reminded me of when. So students, you're going to write this sentence and you're going to complete the sentence as you're listening. You're going to think of one example that reminded you of something and fill in your sentence. Let's begin reading. There are many kinds of courage. Awesome kinds. And everyday kinds. Still, courage is courage, whatever kind. Courage is riding your bicycle for the first time without training wheels. Courage is a spelling bee and your word is super -siliciousness. Super -siliciousness. Courage is two candy bars and saving one for tomorrow. Courage is mealtime and desperately hoping it's not chunky chunks in real gravy again. Courage is nobody better pick on your little brother. Creak, trippity, trap, clack, crack, crunch, ping, pong, slam, ooh, oosh, drip, drip. Courage is it's your job to check out the night noises in the house. Courage is being the new kid on the block and saying flat out, Hi, my name is Wayne. What's yours? Courage is tasting the vegetable before making a face. Courage is not peeking at the last pages of your whodunit book to find out who did it. Courage is being the first to make up after an argument. Okay, students, we're going to stop here. This is halfway through the book and this is as far as we're going to go today because I want you to fill in now your sentence. The courage example of reminded me of when Okay, so go back, listen to the story again, and make sure you write in your sentence from one of the examples that you've heard so far today. Then if you have time after that, you can share your sentence with your group.